Yo, what is going on you guys? Welcome back to episode 4 of the Night Lord Progression series. So in this episode, I kind of want to just talk about what has happened since it has been almost a month now since the last episode. And just kind of talk about my plans moving forward with this character. As usual, I'm still really liking this class. I love bossing with it. I love training with it. And overall, just really enjoy playing this class. I wish I had like more upgrades to show you guys, but hopefully in the patch notes, we are going to be getting a star forcing event if we get a star forcing event i have a ton of money for this character i'm talking like over 200 bills so i think that we should be able to finish this character if we had the spares but i think we'll go into more detail on that later in this video and what my plans are for star forcing but first we did hit level 260 i'm almost 261 so i'm in this dilemma right now if i want to train in cernium or if i want to go and train in limb because as you guys know i do still need fams like i don't know what's going on with not to like i might have to start sending tickets because hey yo i think i'm glitched or something because like i haven't hit my 40 40 40 boss fams yet and i've opened like 100 uniques so i don't really know what's going on but yeah we're kind of just in like familiar waiting room right now kind of praying that we hit something i'm fine with honestly hitting only two boss fams like i know even just two is a lot to ask for but i would much rather just hit two and then go train in Cernium, level up a ton and then come back to limb like later on and also i do need to hit level 265 by march 1st because that's when our Saren party our potential Saren party is going to be running regardless we just gotta hit 265 and then we can come back for fams or just hopefully you know we just train enough and hit 265 in limb the exp i get about like seven percent a whop so only 3.5 percent an hour it's honestly like kind of slow i thought it was going to be a little bit faster but no worries cernium is going to feel that much faster when we go there i wish i had some like familiar opening content for you guys but it's just like one of those things that when you get the fams you just open it right away and just pray you hit i don't even think about pressing the record button i guess i just want to talk about familiars real quick do i think that they should be changed because i know like familiars are a big talk in the community they should be changed they shouldn't be changed well i think for the most part everyone says familiars should be changed but if i'm being honest i think if they just added like fams in cernium this would be fine like we wouldn't even have to worry about that i don't understand like the point of not adding fams in cernium burnium hotel arcus it doesn't make sense like why do you have fams at level 10 maps but you don't have fams at endgame maps it doesn't make sense to me leads me to believe that they want to just get rid of the fams i know that was something that people talked about is there's not gonna be fams in the future but that's for a whole nother video but aside from training i am potentially able to solo sea gloom i think i'm gonna go for a sea gloom solo in the near future i think once we hit level 265 though it'll be more comfortable it's like a really really min damage run at this point like a full 30 minute run so i think i'm gonna wait till i get the level bonus as well as a little bit more arcane force i'll just show you guys my arcane force right now it's crazy how fast arcane symbols level up nowadays i remember back in the day it would take literally a full year i'm not even trolling when i say that it would take a full year to max arcane symbols now you can do it in like a few months in these top three especially choo choo and vj they level so fast it's it's actually insane how quick you guys can level your symbols nowadays we also did get our cernium symbol of course it is level two right now i think once this is level three i'll start training at cernium like i mentioned earlier but i guess let's just go and move into the plans for if there is a 5 10 15 event on the patch notes and just kind of show you guys like what what my expectations are this kind of treasure i think i'm just gonna leave it at 21 i might tap it to 22 who knows we'll see obviously the moisture ring is 22 and we do have a ton of moisture ring spares and i'll tell you guys why in just a second the superior golex ring i do want to tap to 22 and i think it's a pretty safe tap to 22 and i'll tell you guys why i can easily get one of these moisture rings to 22 stars i'll probably just 22 star one beforehand just in case and that'll just be like my miso drop gear but if for some reason this thing glitches out and it booms going to 22 then i just instantly have a moisture ring to transfer into a new one i do have 1200 coins right now so i should have 1400 coins by the time a 5 10 15 comes around so we're chilling on spares here so this is a pretty safe tap confident that we can get this to 22 and if not it's 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 fine 
21 is more than fine but 22 would be awesome obviously roar four superior goal expendant this is one that i'm kind of iffy about because it's 17 stars right now i do not have that many spares i only have three dom pendants we're gonna get one to 21 transferred into the superior goal expendant i should probably keep this at 21 i'm not sure what my plans are with this thing i'm not really sure probably keep it at 21 because i don't have spares for it like that so this will say at 21 this again if we have the spares like i'll try and get this to 21 as well this is obviously gonna say at 17 22 belt for arcanes i have gotten pretty lucky on the arcane drop so i think i'm gonna try and go for 21 arcanes of course i'm gonna roulette them the goal would be 21 if i can't get 21 it is what it is but yeah the goal is gonna be 21 for the arcanes twilight mark i do have three spares i should be able to get this to 21 hopefully praying superior goal x earring and now this is something that i'm also a little bit concerned about because i do have a ton of superior spares i have three spares but i have one two three four five i have five reinforced spares so i should be able to get this at 21 if not 22 again we'll see and yeah that's pretty much what the plans are moving forward i know this video is just a little upkeep video to show you guys where we're at what the plans are moving forward this is one thing that's complicated about doing a progression series at this point in the game because it's like there's not really much upgrades that happen aside from leveling and maybe some boss clears but i hope you guys are still enjoying the series and i hope you guys are invested this character is going to be extremely strong at one point so don't get your hopes down not too up next you guys already know if you guys don't know we do stream every wednesday friday and sunday on twitch you guys can see the progression live over on the twitch we do use face cams over on the twitch as well so if you guys want to see what we look like pull up anyways i hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you guys are not already subscribed please consider subscribing to the channel and as always i hope you guys have a fantastic day i'll see you guys in the next one peace